guys. Uh, this is Jack from Dead Poet Society. Uh, that song's called Swarm, and I'm going to teach you how to play it here today. First, I want to talk to you about my guitar. It's a Schechter Diamond Series. Um, a while back, I my friend took a soldering iron and removed the frets, so it is a fretless seven-string guitar. Um, if you don't have a fretless guitar, you could use a slide or... Or you could go buy a seven string and do the same thing and make it fretless because it's fucking fun to play it like that. But um, anyway, yeah, so I'm producing our record right now. This is my home studio slash bedroom. And I've been self-isolating for about a week. So driving myself pretty fucking crazy. But anyway, I'm going to show you how to play the riff here. Um... What you're going to do is on your 7 string, you're going to tune, or you could probably do it on a 6 string, because I really only use 3 strings. Uh, but the tuning is going to be drop A. Um, and then the next string you don't play, so it doesn't ra really matter. And then uh, A string, 5th string, and then D, 4th string, G, 3rd um, string. And so the riff starts with the low A string. And then you're going to play this octave shape. Um, I don't know if you remember the song. That let song. That's the shape that it's famous from, I think. So you're going to be doing that shape. And you're going to start by hitting the low string. And then you slide up to the 15th. So it goes like that. It's kind of hard to do with... with the intonation, you gotta kinda listen for it when you're playing it. But so you're gonna slide it to the fifteenth, and then you're just gonna go down, sort of pump it all the way down to the fourteenth fret. Um, you're gonna hit seven notes in between the fifteenth and the fourteenth fret, and they're all kind of microtones, so it's it's super nerdy, but basically you're gonna just go up and down and up and down until you get to it. I'll play it for you for you right now. So it's kind of hard to do slow because it just sounds so chaotic, but um, I'll try to do it. So you're just going to kind of slide from wherever's comfortable. And then in between, you're going to do the same kind of three to four fret gap in between each slide. The easiest way to do it is to think about the pinky, it moving in between each fret evenly to get to that 14th fret. And then your first finger is just gonna follow behind on an even octave there. So I'll play for you one more time. <laughs> Kinda hurts your uh, index finger after a while, so make sure to put some grease on that fret board. And then uh, after that, you're gonna do this low riff, which is open A. And then the 15th fret. So you're going to go. Just your typical kind of royal blood riff. And then, uh, so you just combine those two. do that twice and then you're going to move to the verse which goes like this um, so that's going to be the 10th fret on the a string the fifth string up here and the 10th fret on the low A string. So again, they're octaves. And the first one, you're just going to kind of, you know, this kind of like jerk motion. And then you're going to do the rest of the rhythm on that, uh, on the low A string. So it's going to go 10 to 9, like that. And then you're going to do five notes in between the 10th and the 9th fret. So it's going to go. 
So it kind of, it just sounds like this sloth that's going down. Um, <laughs> And then after that, you're going to move to the seventh fret and you're going to go seven down to six and then five up to six on the fifth string. So it's going to go. And that's three notes in between the seventh and sixth fret and the fifth and the sixth. And they kind of just mock each other like that. Um, and that's that's pretty much the whole verse. So um, I hope you enjoyed this video. And, um, oh, also the, the, the tone that I'm using is pretty cool. It's the, it's the new neural DSP from Tosin Abasi. So I'm using the archetype Abasi plugin right now for my guitar. It's, and, uh, that's what we're using to track most of the record. So check that out. Go make yourself, uh, a fretless guitar. Cause it's fucking sick. It's fun. And think outside the box. 